Hello, I'm Technofoxel, and I'm be playing Mermaid Swamp. Apparently, it's an RPG horror, much like Ib, Forest of Drizzly and the Rain, that kind of stuff. And I would play the other ones too, but I've seen someone else play them, so am I supposed to click something? Please tell me I don't have a faulty game. There we go. What the? Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? It's just slightly spooky. Somebody there? Ugh. Ren, wake up! Pixels! Saitaro Wakasuki. Stop sleeping already for crying out loud. Uh, shut up. I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. One hell of a nap. Yuta's been driving all this time and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh, not a hint of a, of a of lady in this one. Okay, so I'm guessing the blonde one is Ren. Not exactly interested in being ladylike for early balding punk like you. Eyes and shine, Ren. Okay, so the one that just turned is blue, so that's Yuka. I'm going to guess you slept well, given you started around noon. Yeah, but thanks to Baldi here, more of a rude awakening. Quit your yammering, Yamazaki. Okay, so the white one is Sai. Hey, Yuda. I'm guessing Yuda's the last one. Where are we anyway? You said something about kicking things into higher gear. But are we in the mountains or what? <coughs> My bad. I don't know where this is either. Like, I'm gonna start using different voices for each one. Huh? You telling me we're lost? Yep. They don't have that first clue where we are. You gotta be. <clears throat> Which one's you? Blue one. You gotta be kidding. You said the mounds were a shortcut, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kinda know at first, but the fog just got so thick. <laughs> We're gonna get. Uh. That ain't funny, shrimp face. This is exactly why I didn't want to go on a trip in your lousy old GPS-less car. Oh, don't kick the seat. Well, now what do we do? I can't even see any signs. Okay, I guess I'm not using different voices. <laughs> huh? Oh, the car died. You know, why did you stop? I didn't. It just stopped. Hold on, I'll turn the engine. Oh, God. I think it's totally- oh, it's totally busted. Are you for real? Dude. You dumbass. Ugh, wait here, I'll go and take a look. No, don't go outside. Don't go outside. Oh, I'm ringing. Okay. I don't want to do this. Can we go back? Can I go back inside? Let me back in. Fuck. I'm gonna die. Huh? Can I do nothing? Oh, I'm supposed to look at the car, but... Nothing looks wrong to me. Why the hell did it stop? Okay, I looked at... Oh, God! S somebody there. <coughs> Excuse me. Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? Just an old coot. Damn it. Don't freak me out. We're on a trip, but our car went kaput, so I guess we're stuck. That's very unfortunate. Is there any way where you can stay? Nah, if we can't get it run, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You needn't do that. My home is nearby. You can stay there, even if it's summer. It's quite cold in the nights. <laughs> Excuse me for one sec. Sorry? Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my buds. Don't do it. That's a relief, thanks, old man. But you sure? We don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see? My house is bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some young folks make use of it. Come on, then. I'm really grateful. We'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Oh, I can see it now. 
A mermaid eating your corpses. Whoa, that place is huge. Damn, how that's a mansion. I kind of feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. Okay, so Ren's an ass. Is Ren the only girl? Whoa, that's not the old man. Whoa, it's really roomy inside, too. You gotta be rich, am I right? <laughs> rich enough to be ashamed of the state of this old place, perhaps. Come along and I'll show you to your rooms. Okay, so I am Ren. You can use this room, Miss Wren. Forgive the old-fashionedness. It ain't nothing. I kind of like the whole retro thing. Thanks again, Gramps. Oh god, I hate you, Ren. Why do I have to be you? I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, make yourself at home. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay. Ooh. Now let's see if there's possible ways to die. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Can I electrocute myself? Something tells me that outlet's gonna be important. The fireplace. The bed. Nightstand. Chest for valuables, maybe? There's nothing inside, though. I'm kinda scared. Nothing inside. Hey, who are you? Sigh. It ain't that old of a building, really. You see that other place out back? No, that's old. Huh? There's another mansion out back? <clears throat> Sorry. The old man tells me they built this one a generation ago since the other one was falling apart. Huh. A large swamp can be seen in front of the house. A clock. Somebody's gonna get the dumb idea to go and check out the other house, ain't they? Nothing. Nothing. Hey, Gramps. Hmm, I don't have much food on hand for this. With chicken and egg and- oh, rice and something? Well, I kinda prefer something beefier, like, literally beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef. I must apologize. Oh well, I'll eat anything on this stomach, or maybe on most stomachs. <laughs> oh, oh, alright. You'll eat your friends. What? Oh, awesome. Well, that's a pleasant sight. That's my future. It's a beautiful painting, though. Creepy, but beautiful. I'm scared. And nothing has even happened. I don't trust mirrors, thanks to it. Or, not mirrors. <laughs> paintings. Why is it all women in water? Well, a uh, mermaid, I guess, but... I'm not going anywhere near water. Oh, it's a sink. I thought it was a key. Nice! Your room has a dresser. I ain't got one in mine. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over to do your makeup in the morning. Yay! Hey, thanks a bunch! <coughs> Sorry. Something tells me this is going to be important. Um, God, people are going to die horribly. And the last one. Hey, Ren, you see that big swamp in front? Yeah, the one you can see out of the windows? It's super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll go swimming tomorrow. Don't. Yeah, uh, stay away from me after you do that, because you're going to wreck. Reek. Oh, God. That's just intimidating. Nothing inside. I'd probably hide in there if I need to. I'm just scared of nothing. Nothing's happened. Fancy. There's a phone. It leads down here. Okay. Maybe you shouldn't walk around too much. I don't want Grams finding me get mad. What do I do? back here.
you saw that. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, that's one big swamp. Hmm? I can't read that. What's this? A stone monument? Uh, <clears throat> a band deed abduct from the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. Maybe Saito did know about the sold stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. Curious about the monument? Ah! Jeez, old man, you gotta not do that. Ma, oh, my apologies. Did you read the inscription? Nah, I couldn't make heads or tails of it. What does it say? It's a legend that's told around here. The legend of the so-called mermaid swamp. Legend? It originated in the middle of the Maiji area. My family has governed this area since around that time. It is said to be said the sins of Alita descended from the mountains down to the seaside and discovered a mermaid. Sounds shady right out of the gate. <laughs> well, it is a legend. A man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that he took her to his mountain home. He created a fish tank for her to live in, and he filled it with water from this very swamp. But a mermaid out of, of the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, and her voice as melodic as ringing bells was reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid took on a most repulsive form, and subsequently died. And a mermaid's wrath is no petty thing. Young women have vanished from the nearby village. It is said to be the mermaid's curse. I'm gonna die. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless, yes? Uh, um, <clears throat> sorry. Don't know about all that. Tell it to Saitaru. He likes stories and stuff. Oh, is that right? Well, I've prepared dinner now, so come to the dining room if you would. Ooh, finally. Let's get a move on. Mmm, delish. This is some great stuff, old man. I'm glad you like it. You can slow down a little, though. Oh, the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. We must be tired from the day's events. Please rest yourselves. Yuka, you aren't gonna eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm just too tired to have an appetite. Well, you okay? We'll clean up. You can get some rest. Alright, thanks, Yuta. Yummy, yummy. Y'all clean up now. Why do you have to clean- Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yummy yucky. <clears throat> yeah, work on your names while you're at it. Man, I'm stuffed. I'm ready to conk out after that bath. I'm not, because I'm going to die.